everybody how's it going back with another video at least i've been doing them things are going pretty good the other day i was editing a whole bunch of video as you know between the video cards and the water coolers and everything else that goes with it it was taking a long time and i was thinking wow man i wish i had something that i could use to speed up the process a little bit because there's a lot of stopping starting cutting just if you've ever done it you realize what i'm talking about i'm gonna do a unboxing and a short video to take a look at the stream deck pedal i know this is probably video number 599 out of all the content creators but maybe i'm the first novice content creator to get to do it so let's just take a quick look at it from what i understand it has a lot of features with it that could really be helpful and the great thing about it is they go for like 80 89 dollars and i didn't want to spend 89 dollars i was looking at it on amazon there was a sale on it for like 79 or something like that then i realized that i had enough credit on my card where i could get this for nothing off of my points so what the hey freebie well i paid for it in the long run obviously but that's besides the point so to open the box obviously my phone's ringing Okay, as I was saying before my phone B and E'd my conversation. Looks like it's just a pull tab in the front to open the box. Am I getting weak in my old age? Okay, I don't need this. Well, it comes packaged, nice. Directions, a bunch of thingies. A nice sleeved braided A to C USB cable for power and does come with a little manual in the manual. I got a really, really nice compliment today. A guy went back and looked at one of my earlier videos and he sent me an email this morning saying that he 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 became a subscriber and he, he um made my day. He, he was like you know, it's refreshing to see someone that's upfront and real about their conversations i'm not biased towards any single product and i'm not really if it's good it's good if it sucks it sucks but i hope he gets to watch this and i want to say thanks i would say your call sign or your name on here but i'm not sure if you'd want that so anyways thank you that was awesome you really did make my day so we're back it basically just some simple instructions on how to plug it in more instructions over here on what you can use it with and wow you can use it with a lot of stuff streamlabs obs obs um soundboard system websites hotkeys that's what i'm going to want it for hotkeys absolutely you can use it with your mixer you can use it in games Say I play a lot of Quake Champions and your character always has a secondary um, power, whether it would be shooting fire when you're running and gunning or um, going invisible, what it, what, whatever it may be, you can use it to assign a hotkey to it and send it off in that direction without having to worry about fumbling around with either the keyboard all your side keys pretty cool i think i'm going to try to hook it up to my car because my gas and my brake pedal are getting worn out so i'm going to see if it will work on my car i didn't say that okay it also comes with screws i'm i'm, I'm going to bring the video in a little closer for y'all so you can get a quick a closer look at this i'm using a lav mic today i picked one up with a adapter that can go into my go xlr it's a 3.5 to um, XLR adapter and it seems to be working pretty good I'm just hoping that the sound quality is decent with it I didn't use any filters on it or anything yet but anyways onward so it comes with obviously they must be in these bags and some stoppers okay so it comes with three different sets of springs I don't know what's in it if there even is any in it it has soft medium which is default and then there's probably some thicker ones which are hard. It will adjust the amount of pressure you can put down on the pedals. I'm really dying to use this. This is perfect. At least I get to do a little video on this so I could do the video with it. Get the hotkey signed up to it. So again, yeah, just directions on all the different programs you can use it with. I guess you can use it with everything from Windows, websites, hotkey assignments, games, soundboards, stream deck. Oh, oh, of course it's Elgato product that'll work with a stream deck. OBS, Streamlabs OBS, game capture. Okay, all right, I have to check that out. Game capture, I think that might be the no, uh, NVIDIA, NVIDIA thing. 
So let's take a quick look just in one of these. I don't want to open every one of them if I don't have to. Yeah. Okay, so these are the 700s, it says. Okay, 700 is soft. And I guess it comes with a number of them. 1400, so you got different levels of soft. You have 17 and 14 in soft. You have 16 and 800 in soft. And then you have 1000 and 2000 in soft. And every one of these has them in there. Very cool. I'm probably going to end up putting it on to 2000 because I have kind of a heavy foot that feels pretty it has a lot of give to it so i'm taking it there isn't anything in there and if you don't want to use the center pedals or the left or the right pedal let me take this out of here nice job packaging oh god i'll never spare any expense very nice very clean wow it's heavy heavy duty okay so you would take out the screws on the bottom and that's where you would put your springs for your pressure adjustment and it also comes with some stoppers so if you want to stop so the stop is basically if i wanted to take a couple of springs out i could put these plastic stoppers in there pedal from pressing down this way it wouldn't activate yeah there we go just a couple small stoppers so they pop right on in there elgato's always coming out with something what's next the monitor I think they've got all the bases covered. They just came out with mics. They came out with um, lights. They came out with foot pedals. They were basically known for their capture cards. Now they've got everything. I've actually got one of their low profile mic arms on my desk and I love it. It's just, it swings underneath all my monitor. It's, it's awesome, love it. So I guess we'll take a quick look inside of here and see what's in there, why not? Oh boy, yep. You can see where the springs are pushing it right out. Let's set it down. Bingo. There's your springs. Wow, okay. It's not as complicated as I thought. I obviously flip it upside down and put it on, put the springs in, flip it upside down. Okay, it has some ribbons on the inside where you can, where it's used to control the, the pedals. Sends the data, telling it what to do. USB-C. And I guess, without reading the directions yet, I am guessing that this is some type of a reset button. So if it's assigned, maybe if it's assigned something, you can press that and send it to default. Anyways, well, all right. Very, very cool. I think I'm gonna leave the medium in and give them a shot for now. Okay, the bottom plate has two little tabs on it that you slide into. Some slots, they're probably half inch slots. And then you can just basically hold it down in the back and screw everything down. So they did make everything pretty easy. I don't want to sock it. I mean, it's not a CPU where you gotta crisscross everywhere, but I just wanted to put a couple in real quick so we could set it back down. And there we have it. I'm happy I have it. Can't wait to try it, depending on where you're looking at. You've got your left, your right, and your center. Oh, I'm going to give it a shot. And in my next video, I'll let you all know how it worked out. Knowing Elgato, it's going to work out fine. I don't see any reason why not. On that note, if you're new to my channel, please do me a favor and subscribe. If you're not new to the channel and you're watching this video, Take a second, give me a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. And believe me, it really, really helps the channel out a lot. So, got things to do. It's still early in the day. And I got to go to my other job. Fun, fun. <laughs> I hope all you stay safe. Remember, wash your hands. Take care of yourself. That virus is still out there. I still know people getting sick. So stay healthy, stay safe. Everybody have a great, great rest of your week. All weekend, if that's when you watch this. Take care.